Here are the eight deadliest plants and trees. These plants will make you think twice before stepping out into Mother Nature. Number eight, oleander. Oleander can be found all over the Arabian Peninsula and in parts of Asia. This toxic plant is considered to be one of the most common poisonous plants in the world. It's toxic throughout all parts of the plant. Anyone who ingests it may experience heart problems, abdominal pains, seizures, vomiting, nausea, skin irritation, and diarrhea. In a tragic incident in 2000, two toddlers died after ingesting oleander. Two and three-year-old Alexi and Peter Wiltsey became the first confirmed cases of oleander-induced deaths in the United States. Medical experts asserted that this was a highly unusual case and that it is rare for anyone to actually die from ingesting the plant. Number seven, Devil's Helmet. Also known as wolfsbane or the queen of all poisons, devil's helmet refers to a genus of plants with more than 250 species. For humans who manage to ingest devil's helmet, they will likely experience symptoms similar to rabies. One would start excessively salivating, have vertigo, and a loss of vision. They may even end up in a coma if they do not seek proper treatment. Those affected may also experience burning and numbness feelings in their face. Other symptoms include severe diarrhea and difficulty breathing. Autopsies usually cite asphyxiation as a cause of death. Large doses of devil's helmet have the potential to kill a person very quickly, sometimes within just two hours of poisoning. The best treatments for anyone suffering from the effects of devil's helmet include monitoring blood pressure or using activated carbon. The ancient Greeks used to use the toxins from the plant on their darts in order to kill wolves, hence its nickname Wolfsbane. The plant is even referenced in the world-famous narrative poem Metamorphosis by Ovid, in which he explains that the plant comes from the mouth of a three-headed dog that stands guard at the gates of hell. Number 6. Angel's Trumpet Angel's Trumpets is a woody shrub that is actually extinct in the wild. They're indigenous to tropical regions in South America, such as Brazil, Chile, and Venezuela, but are mainly grown in isolation. Any part of the plant has the potential to be highly poisonous, and if ingested, can result in a wide range of symptoms. Once Angel's Trumpet is in your system, certain muscles become paralyzed, and you will commonly experience sweating, an increased heart rate, diarrhea, and vomiting. One is also likely to experience extreme hallucinations, both auditory and visually. These hallucinations have been described as terrifying, and people have been known to go into trances and completely lose awareness. One of the most bizarre examples of such behavior was documented in psychiatry and clinical neuroscience, when a man cut off his own penis and tongue after consuming Angel's Trumpet. The plant is even known to cause death to many of its victims. In some cultures, it can be used as a form of punishment. Ancient tribes in South America used to make misbehaving children take the drug, believing it will allow their ancestors from the spirit world to speak to them. It has also been used for medicinal purposes, usually as an external treatment. However, some cultures have used non-lethal doses to induce vomiting with the intent of expelling worms or parasites from a person's digestive system. Number 5. Tobacco Tobacco leaves are most commonly used in cigarettes, cigars, and pipes for smoking. Tobacco contains nicotine, a stimulant that is often quite addictive. Tobacco users often risk serious health problems such as liver and kidney damage, heart diseases, and lung cancer. The World Health Organization concluded that around 100 million people died from tobacco use during the 20th century. While tobacco itself may not be particularly harmful, there are thousands of chemicals used to make cigarettes, which often exacerbate the health side effects. In addition to lung cancer, tobacco use can lead to stomach cancer, cancers in the mouth, and pancreatic cancer. Tobacco can also cause heart attacks, chronic pulmonary diseases, emphysema, and stroke. Another concern is the use of child labor in some countries. In places such as Zimbabwe, Chile, Indonesia, Malawi, and Brazil, child laborers are often employed to harvest tobacco. In addition to allegations of physical and sexual abuse by their supervisors, many children have suffered from green nicotine poisoning. This is a severe condition in which wet tobacco leaves are absorbed by the skin and can cause severe dizziness, vomiting, and nausea. Number 4. The Manchinal Tree also known as the Little Apple of Death, the manchineal tree is a plant found in the tropical regions of North and South America. It's primarily native to places such as the Caribbean, the Bahamas, Mexico, and Central America, as well as the state of Florida. These trees bear fruits that resemble tiny apples that are extremely poisonous, hence its nickname, the Little Apple of Death. In fact, manchineal trees are one of the most deadly plant species in the world. Its toxins are very powerful. 
The sap from their trees are so toxic that simply standing underneath the trees during a rainstorm will cause your skin to blister. This is because the sap contains a high level of corbal, which is a skin irritant. Exposure for long periods of time can result in death. A long time ago, a tribe in coastal South America called the Carib Indians would sometimes tie their captives to these trees as a means of torture. They would even use a sap to poison their arrowheads before battle. These trees are frequently referenced in literature and journals throughout history. One such example is in the Buccaneers of America, wherein the author cuts off a branch of the tree to use as a fan, wishing to swat away bugs and to cool down. Instead, his skin quickly blistered all over. His face swelled up so large that he could barely see for three days. While the fruits have the potential to be fatal, quick and swift treatment can oftentimes save a person's life. If consumed, however, the little apple of death will cause bleeding, shock, bacteria infections, and gastrointestinal problems. Number 3 white snake root. Native to North and Central America, white snake root also goes by monikers such as tall bonset, white sanicle, or richweed. However, its scientific name is Agaratina altisma. It is one of the leading causes of milk sickness, a disease that is marked by severe vomiting, trembling, and intense intestinal pain. Other symptoms include delirium, loss of appetite, constipation, abdominal pain, and even death. Milk sickness is often passed from cattle to humans. When cattle eat the poisonous plants, their meat and bones become contaminated. Humans who then consume the contaminated cattle consequently become affected themselves. In the 19th century, thousands of American settlers died when they began living in areas where the plant grew. Unfamiliar with the dangers of white snake root, they consumed dairy products from cows and goats. It's believed that Abraham Lincoln's mother died from milk sickness. These days, it's very rare for a person to suffer from milk sickness. Thanks to advances in agriculture and a higher awareness of its effects, the likelihood of falling victim to white snake root poisoning has been significantly reduced. Number 2. Belladonna Also known as deadly nightshades, these toxic plants are native to Europe, North America, and Western Asia. They produce extremely poisonous berries. Though it's had medical uses in the past, the berries from this plant will cause hallucinations and delirium. With a high amount of tropane alkaloids, belladonnas are among the most deadly plants in the Eastern Hemisphere. If one were to consume its berries, they would experience urinary retention, constipation, rash, headache, a loss of balance, confusion, and hallucination. They are described as resembling blueberries, which often pose a danger. Just eating two of these berries is enough to kill an adult human. The same goes for a single leaf. Belladonna is commonly referred to in European folklore. It was once believed that witches used it as part of a concoction to help them fly. It's also suspected that Agrippina the Younger used it to kill her husband, Augustus, the Roman Emperor. In smaller doses, they are sometimes used as a recreational drug due to the hallucinations they cause. However, they still pose serious health concerns such as learning problems and memory loss, and the hallucinations have been said to be very disturbing. Number 1. The Castor Bean also known as ricinus, castor is a flowering plant native to eastern Africa and the Mediterranean. Although it is the source of castor oil, which has various uses, it has the potential to be quite toxic. Raw castor beans contain ricin, a toxin that's lethal in even the smallest of doses. Ricin is dangerous because it prevents cells from producing protein. Since it often does not take effect for several hours after ingestion, it is a popular ingredient of intentional poisoning. It's been used throughout history in infamous assassination attempts, such as in 1978 when Bulgarian secret police poisoned Georgi Markov. In another incident, an actress named Shannon Richardson sent a letter laced with ricin to US President Barack Obama, a crime that put her in prison for 18 18 years. Several governments have even explored using ricin in weapons, though they have not found an effective way to do so. Those who ingest ricin will experience symptoms such as dehydration, burning sensations in the mouth and throat, a drop in blood pressure, and bloody diarrhea. If not treated quickly enough, one can die in as little as 3 to 5 days after its consumption. Find out more about each of these deadly plants by subscribing or clicking on one of the links below.